always got a tough guy spraying pineapple vintage. Oh my god, a scar like that spraying pineapple vintage. Hi, this is a review of Aventus 0022 Fruity for Men by Perfume Parlor. On my bottle here, it has um, Aventus M, which M stands for men or male, I suppose. I bought this nearly a year ago. So when I bought this, uh, this was the only Ventus that was um, available on the site. But now you've got a woody version as well. So this is Aventus M. This is um, pretty much the same as uh, Aventus Fruity. I'm just going to take a, a quick sniff of this. All right. Um, the opening of this, it's kind of a, it's got a tart, a pineapple. You definitely get the the bergamot, and it's moderately smoky. Um, before I, I get too much into it, I just want to talk about the performance on this. This lasts um, over twelve hours, and it's got about three to four hours projection and it's got a good sillage. Uh, the pineapple in this, um, it's not really kind of a sweet kind of fruity pineapple. Um, as I said before, it's um, a tart pineapple. The uh, main notes I'm getting this are bergamot, pineapple, birch, patchouli. I've seen various videos on this on uh, YouTube some videos very complimentary saying that it's indistinguishable from Aventus some reviews saying that this is absolutely terrible now what I must say that these reviews were for the spray version not for the oil obviously I'm reviewing the oil um, what I'll say myself in comparison to Aventus is that I'm um, what you're getting here is you're getting a very linear fragrance that doesn't really change throughout the 12 hours. Obviously, it's just getting weaker as it progresses. So it pretty much stays the same, what you're kind of getting. From me, you're getting what I would call would possibly be stage two out of the four stages of Aventus, which is, which is it's the stage that comes after the opening. And you get that kind of birch, tart, kind of burnt pineapple. And, um, you know, that's not a bad thing. It's um, it's probably the phase that most people um, enjoy and, what's, and what kind of makes uh, Aventus so popular. Um, I would say that this is about 90 to 95% similar to Aventus at this stage. Maybe it's not as rich or doesn't have as much depth, but it's pretty much bang on. This lacks, for me, um, the first stage, stage one, which is that kind of uh, fruity, um, citrusy, pineapple blast. Now, that could be simply because that this is an oil. If I had a spray, maybe I would get that, but um, I don't get it. Um, I'm not... Also, I'm not getting for me the third stage and uh, the birch note dies down. And like a lot of Aventus clones, well, for me, every Aventus clone I've sampled, I don't really seem to get to those base notes where it gets a bit creamy, it gets a bit clean smelling. So, all in all, like um, you could say that it's maybe 80% of the Aventus experience, but. Is a person going to think that you're wearing a Ventus if you're wearing this? Yeah. Um, the only person that is probably not going to fool is yourself. If you think that you're going to get the Aventus experience for the price of this, which is about, about what, five, six pound, it's not going to happen. What you will get is you'll get 12 hours of that um, birch, burnt pineapple phase. And, you know, that's not a bad thing. I mean, you've got to take the price of these clones into consideration and, you know, what you're going to get for your money. 
Um, if you go in to buying clones with low expectations, you won't be disappointed. Um, you must remember that Aventus is a very expensive fragrance and this is this is worth a few pounds, so you've got to be realistic. It's a very good clone and it's one of the best clones that I've sampled. I just got to give a reminder again that I bought this almost a year ago, so I don't know what the quality of um, the Aventus that's been sold on the site is currently. Um, from a few people that I've spoken to, um, there's no indication that it has changed. Um, when I bought this a year ago, there was a lot of talk. The perfume parlor wasn't as good as it used to be, so, you know, the talk hasn't really changed since then. It definitely gets a thumbs up from me. If you found this video interesting, please give me a like. And if you want to see more of these videos, please subscribe. Thank you.